The following video has been Fat Boy approved. These are the shill free opinions of Fat Boy. Every product reviewed is bought and paid for by Fat Boy. Yeah, yeah. What is going on, everybody? It is your boy. Welcome in the Fat Boy Fragrance Reviews, and of course, you know who I am. I am Mr. Fat Boy, aka the realest baby, aka the shield free man at Fragcom, aka the hardest working man at Fragcom. I put out the content daily, baby. Hope you are enjoying the day. I hope you have a beautiful week, and we're ending up, you know, having a great, great, uh, had a great vacation. We're back, I'm back at work now. I was there, I cut all this content, so we got plenty of content for the week. And we're going to be talking about some a double dip review on some mirror image fragrances. Going to do a couple of these uh, this week. They're going to be fun. And I can't wait to share them with y'all. But first, if you are new to this channel, please hit the like and subscribe and join the Fat Boy family. We love to have you a place of positivity, of energy. And I promise you my best effort every time. All right. If you want to sample my mirror image uh, fragrances, you can go over to fatboyfragrance.com. Fatboyfragrance.com where the customer always smells right. I'll leave the link for full bottles also, so that you can get directly from Mirror Image. All right, so let's go. We got two great ones, and I mean some blue bangers. And you know how we do it. No edits, baby. No do-overs. One take. And one take, and I always get it right. Fatboy Fragrance Review starts now. We are back, and today we are talking about Blue Ocean from Mirror Fragrances and Blue, 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 Blue Island. Okay, I wore both of these extensively. I got my full feelings on them. Matt Lusk over at Mirror Image does a, a couple of different things well, but what he does really well is blend fragrances. I'm a big fan of his hybrids. I have over maybe I think 25 of them already now, 30 of them I think. So I'll be going through more of these reviews as I go. I tried doing them in double dip form so you can get two of them at once. So we're going to start off here first with Blue Blue Island. This one consists of Isola Blue from Rosa Dub, which y'all know I love. It's a 10 out of 10 fragrance. Uh, one of my former signature scent, uh, Chanel uh, Blue to Chanel EDP. And then also has, I think, Becker Roots, no, it has Becker Roots 540, I think. Hold on. I know it has, uh, no, I'm sorry. It doesn't have Becker Roots 540. Hold on. It has um, uh, a solo blue, blue Chanel Eau de Parfum, Gentle Fluidity from MFK, and John Paul Gutierrez Le Mans. Now, when we do these hybrids, we want to see if we have basically three things can happen. It's either going to be a jumble mess and not work, it's going to be a perfect blend of all the fragrances. Or it's going to be a brand new fragrance all together. So let's see what this one does. Here's one more good look at the bottle. Blue, Blue Island. This is a 50 ml. Beautiful uh, holographic label. Matt does a great job with these presentations. So let's put it in the air. Put it in the skin. And we'll get started. Oh, man, oh man. You definitely pick up on the Blue de Chanel in the air. With that wraparound of the um, Isola Blue for sure. Um, you do get a little bit of the of the Jean Paul Gutier Le Mans also in the air, and a little bit of gentle fluidity silver. It's just all you can really smell all three of them working together, all four of them working together to make a really nice fragrance here. Oh my God, does this smell good? This is a beautiful blue aquatic dress me up formal kind of fragrance in my opinion. This is something you want to wear on a date for sure. It is a beautiful fragrance. What I pick up in the beginning, like I said, I get a lot of that Isola Blue and Blue de Chanel leading the way. But there is this nice little background with Le Mans, which we all love John Paul Gutierrez. Le Mans Parfum is one of their best uh, flankers from the line. But Gentle Fluidity is, is slept on. It's a beautiful fragrance too. A nice citrus bite to it. Uh, so this fragrance just knocks. So how I would describe this fragrance. Think about Blue de Chanel and Solo Blue mixed together with a sweet kind of vibe to it, like a vanilla sweet vibe in there. 
That's the vibe I get from this fragrance, and I gotta say, it is a stunner. It is a beautiful fragrance. I, I, I cannot tell you the wow factor in this fragrance, and both of these I'm reviewing today. So, <laughs> it smells really good in here. So, as far as um, what the fragrance is, it is kind of a unique blend of all four. I can still pick them apart, but it's not a whole new fragrance, but it's a unique blend and a well done blend of those four that you can kind of pick them out in a, in a nice way. It's done really well. So let's find out if Blue Blue Ocean gets my full seal approval and we'll wrap this one up and go to the next one. All right, so performance. Okay, four hours, five hours tops on these on this one right here. And you guys, I would go heavy on the sprays and spray your clothes. Don't go cheap on the sprays. Spray as much as you want because you will not be disappointed as far as you won't be over spraying. You'll smell great. Blue Blue Ocean, phenomenal smelling fragrance. But uh, for as far as performance, it's not amazing. It's okay. I'll give it about a half a check on that. All right, so second box. First impressions, it's a 100% full check on that one. This, 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 this thing in the air and on the skin, when you first smell it, amazing. No funk, no offness, just perfect. All right, third box. Compliment factor and does the wifey like it? The wifey loved it. Common Factor, absolutely. Got one when I was going to the gym and, and work. Both places got a comment, two comments on this bad boy. This is a stunner. Hardest thing is explaining all the fragrances that are in it. But, so, final box. So check that box. This is a huge compliment getter, no doubt. So final box, how much do I recommend this fragrance? I give this to 100% approval. Blind bottle worthy. If you're looking for a blue, aquatic, sweet vanilla fragrance, here you go, a knockout. Oh man, it just gets better and better. You pick up more as it dries down to with the Le Mans. So yes, this one's a full seal approval, no doubt. All right, so the next one's called Blue Ocean. Now, what happens when you take my two favorite Roja releases in the last, you know, five years, and that's Oceana and a Solar Blue. You put them together, you get Blue Ocean. Now, this one has been on my radar for a little while. I finally got it, and I was not disappointed at all. This is probably my favorite hybrid so far in the year. This is just, it's that good. In the air, oh my God. Uh, the thing with Oceana has a little bit of a offness sometimes, and that's from the Rosa version too. But that's gone. That little rough part of Ocean is gone, replaced with these Sola Blue's beautiful qualities. What this has done is take any kind of genericness that Sola Blue might have had, that my wife thinks it had, because she thinks it's kind of a generic blue fragrance, and she said this is actually a stunning, niche-smelling kind of fragrance now. So when you when when these were combined by Matt, this just amplified the beauty of a Sola Blue and got rid of that harshness a little bit from Oceana. So it took the bad parts of each of the fragrances and got rid of them and only kept the good parts. And it created a phenomenal, unique blue summer fragrance that is the quintessential thing you wanna wear this summer if you wanna impress. I cannot stress to you how good this smells. You do get a blend of both of them. Um, I don't feel like it's a full new fragrance. I feel like you can still pick them apart. It's a perfect blend. I would say it's probably 60% Oceana and 40% Isola Blue. But man, it's done so well. As it dries down, I get more Isola Blue and less Oceana. It becomes more 50-50 towards the dry down. All right, so let's see if this one gets my full seal approval and we'll get out of here, okay? All right, performance. Lacking on performance. Two to three hours max. Another one you're gonna have to heavy spray. Performance is not good on this one. But, you know, I'm gonna give it about a quarter of a check. It's, it can't get a full check. You know, performance, I wish it was better, but it isn't, but it, it makes up for it in other categories, and we're about to share that with you now. First impressions, absolutely stunning. You're gonna love the way it smells. You're gonna love the way it sits on your skin when you first smell it. You're gonna to wanna to respray this as much as you want to, because you're gonna love the opening. Okay, full check on that. 
Compliment factor. It is a 1 million, 100% check the full box. The wifey loved it. it. This is a compliment getter. I didn't get one wearing it, but damn, damn sure that this is a compliment getter, no doubt, in my opinion. This will get you compliments. This is the one that easy, dumb reach to go for. Easy one to wear, casual situations, gym, work, summertime, daytime, wear it out. But spray heavily or bring you a travel decant with you. All right, so full check on that. Final box, how much do I recommend it? Even though the performance is lacking, I still give this a 100% approval. I still think it's one of the best hybrids this year that's come out from Matt, period. Blue Ocean is a hit, a must have in your collection. If you love the Solo Blue and you love Oceana, but you don't like the roughness sometimes in Oceana, and you wish the Solo Blue had a little bit more uniqueness to it, combine them and you got a hit. And if you like, those four fragrances are in here in um, Blue Blue Ocean, like Blue to Chanel EDP, uh, Isola Blue, John Paul Gaultier's uh, uh, um, um, Le Mal Parfum, and uh, Gentle Fluidity Silver. You can't miss this. This is a perfect blend of those four and you can still pick them apart. Not two new fragrances, but two great hybrids. Definitely worth checking out. There you go, full seal approval, blind bottle worthy. Sell them at FatboyFragrance.com or buy you a full bottle. That's all the time I got. I hope you enjoyed the video. And you know, I always tell you, baby, if you smell good like I do right now, and you feel good, then it's going to be all good. Fatboy Fragrance Reviews is out.